Hi Philip and welcome to your um, website tutorial. So um, basically to edit your website you otherwise recommend having like um, a tab here open on the front end section so the front end is the visible uh, part of the website and one extra tab open to the back end so the administration of WordPress. WordPress is your content management system for your website. So to access website you can log in by uh, going to familylawyerab.com slash WP admin right uh, you got that you got this URL in the um, website profile sheet I've sent you Right, so now it's it's pretty easy, right? To update anything on the on the home page, uh, start it here. You just uh, when you logged in, actually, you just refresh the page. You just uh, press F5, or you just like refresh here, right? Clicking here, and uh, then you got this black bar here, which is the typical uh, WordPress admin bar. So to edit the page, basically you just click on edit with WordPress. Um, I'd always recommend uh, clicking right click on it and open a new tab. Okay, so that's in French here, but um, the equivalent in English is open in a new tab. So I click there, and here I'm just gonna wait that the the editor is loading. So always do the mode to press because it's going to be way easier for you to, uh, to edit your website. And now you got the, uh, the editor section here. So let's say you want to change the text. You just click on the text here. You double click on it. And here you see you can change whatever you like. Right? So you type whatever you want in there. Uh, you can do all the same right by double clicking on properties and uh, like titles. Uh, the learn more buttons normally you shouldn't change them but uh, here you see there's a link to the page so if you see like if you want to change a link uh, you can change that right here um, if you click on here this is a spacer so the spacer has been um, computed so that like all the button here are lined up okay uh, on like big screen so you can play with this as well, like uh, changing the size of the spacer, uh, but in any case, normally you shouldn't have to do anything here unless you want to change the text. Okay, um, <clears throat> same thing here, you can change about here, here, here to change the uh, the pictures, you need to click here and edit WordPress text. Okay, and here, um, if you want to, to let's say change a picture, you click there and you click on edit. <clears throat> <coughs> when you're here, you can click on replace. And here, if you want to change the picture, you click just click on update new file. Basically, click update new file, and you'll be able to replace these files. Okay. Normally, you shouldn't have to do it, but um, just keep the same size. The new new picture should be 500 by 5, 5 uh, by 559 pixel. All right. <clears throat> uh, same thing, right? Fold in the picture. You can edit it by clicking here and edit. Okay, and that's it for the main part of the home page. Now let's say you want to change the, the tagline here. Tagline is in a widget. So we'll I'll leave this um, this section here. Click on close. So do not forget to click on update when you're done. I'm gonna click on close. I'm gonna I'm gonna run cursor attention. Sorry, I hope I'm, you've seen the mouse properly. Um, all right, so now I'm here. If I want to change what's there, I go in appearance widgets, appearance widgets, and there is um, I think it's a header sidebar. No, it's not. It's the secondary sidebar. No, it's not. Have sidebar bottom. Uh, yeah, it's here. So the head sidebar bottom. That's what you see right here, helping you move forward. Blah blah blah. So you can change whatever you want here and here. 
Okay, the tagline looking forward, that's what's showing up here. Okay, now let's say you want to edit an inside page. So you want to edit uh, one of the services page like divorce. Click on there. And same thing, right click on edit with MotuPress, open in a new tab, <coughs> and it's going to load the page. <coughs> There you go. And same thing here. So you double click on the text, click on edit WordPress text, and here you can change whatever you like. Okay. So you can change the text and then save. And do not forget to click on update when you're done. Um, what else do we have here? Uh, resources. That's a simple page. Uh, the last uh, thing is. If you want to change your blog, right? If you want to change the, the blog or add a new post, basically you're going into posts here. And here, so this is the posts of the blog. So you just have to create a new post, basically. So super easy. Just click on add new. And you can click on you can click on test, test new posts. And uh, we're going to publish it into the blog category. And I'm just going to click on publish. And if you want to, sorry, if you want to set up an image associated with your post, you just click on here, set featured image. You can upload new files by clicking here, upload new files, and you just go into your um, computer browsing for the right, uh, right file. Okay. Uh, once you're here, you just click on publish. So now your new, uh, new post has been published. If we go on blog, normally we should see it. There you go. So test uh, post is right here. Okay. So I'm going to remove it for now. Uh, move to trash. I'm going to click on move to trash. And there you go. And I think that's pretty much it. If you want to change anything right there, that's in the widget as well. Uh, so we go in uh, same thing, appearance widget, and you're looking just search for in the footer, basically footer, footer text contact me. So here you can change you can change the the address in case uh, she's moving, uh, phone number and stuff, uh, sidebar. I have a question. Um, yeah, I think we'll remove this one. Um, text. That's the disclaimer. And that's the that's the menu for um, spells and child related services at the bottom. Normally, you shouldn't have to change that anyway. Um, all right. I think that's pretty much it. And connect. Okay, same thing here. If you want to edit anything here, just click on Edit with MotoPress. Same thing, right? Um, mm, 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 what else? You can play around with the color if you want by going into Cherry Options. And that's the theme option. So you can play around with this. Um, normally, you shouldn't have to touch it, but you can go and, and, and change whatever like uh, setup you want for uh, your theme here. So there are some colors, um, font size, and, and stuff like this. You can, you can play around. If you have a really specific question that I, that you can't find, just uh, give me a call and I'll, um, I'll, I'll do a new tutorial for you. All right. Hope that it's uh, clear enough. And um, I wish you a great day. Thank you, Philip.